women don't want no scrubs? Yes or no? No, we don't. <laughs> we don't. I wrote a song about it. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So before we get into this video today, we want to ask you guys to please like the video and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification. Also, like wherever it's at, just click on that and make sure it's on. All right, thank you. Um, and also, if you'd like, go to Patreon as well to go see some exclusive content from us. And yeah, we'll get into it. Having a great time here. And right now uh, we're talking about, would you ever date down? I've never heard this expression, but we are going toe to toe on, based on this unscientific survey. Uh, the, the dating service called It's Just Love. So we're clear. Sure it uh, is, by the way. We managed to make it through the entire run without ever doing a scientific survey. So that's yeah. good. Science has no place on daytime television. Absolutely not. Right. Notice that they completely discredited the survey mm -hmm. because they know that it's going to be shocking to their audience. Yeah. Because I'm assuming their audience is majority women. And they're pretty much saying, you know, Whatever this survey says, it's this not it's not true. Uh, this anyway, this survey, this very unscientific study, found that 79% of women said that the person that they're dating makes significantly less money. If they do, it's not going to work, um, and that it could be a, a total deal deal breaker. Okay. On the other hand, uh, apparently 68% of men, two thirds, say they are fine with women making less than they do, even if well. The women don't want no scrubs. Oh, and that's a clue. That is a clue. Two very special guests here today. A very, very funny fella. And of course, she taught us all about what a scrub is in the group TLC. It's Sherrod Small and Rosanda Chili Tucks. Uh, it's only fair that we go to Chile. Uh, women don't want no scrubs? Yes or no? No, we don't. <laughs> we don't. I wrote a song about it. And, um, hey, you know, there's nothing wrong with riding passengers. Do you remember the comeback to this? No. I don't want no pigeons. <laughs> what? Yo, you guys Did comment. You, swear? you guys comment below if you remember I don't want no pigeons. I don't But when you are on the passenger side and you're trying to talk to a female as if it were your ride. Oh. oh I, I, do, I, do, I do that. I go like this. Turn down our radio. I'm trying right. to talk to somebody. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's my life. So what? <laughs> have you, Sherrod, have you, have you done it? What, date it down? Up. Oh, date uh. it up. Everything's up from where I'm standing. <laughs> Keep my girl confused because I'm on TV so much. She's like, he gotta be making money, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> She's confused. Meanwhile, for you, what how did you like go about finding a man? Given it's gotta be hard to date Chili. Life. It's gotta be. That's a lot of pressure on a dude, right? Well, I mean, if you even saw my show, what Chili wants, it was, yeah, <laughs> I mean, I am very picky. Right. And uh, I think everybody should be, you know, but um, here's my issue with the, I guess you want to call it dating down. I hate that. I that do sounds, too. I'm not comfortable with that term. bad. It makes us mean. Seems shallow. Let's just something. talk about scrubs. It is shallow. Obviously. That's the problem. Why yeah. are you trying to dress it up that it's not shallow? It mm -hmm. is shallow. Exactly the way it sounds is mm -hmm. exactly what it is. Yeah. I don't appreciate her trying to promote you should be picky like me. And then, because obviously, I'm assuming she's single right. while the taping of this. Right. She had a dating show, mm -hmm. had no success in that apparently. And she's admitting that she's super picky. Right. And be like me and be single. What? Right. At this time, I believe she was in her 40s, late 30s. Okay. I don't know her current uh, status right now. Okay. But let's assume for a moment that she's single. I mean, what kind of message are you telling your audience, right? You're telling women that are 40 plus to be extremely picky yeah. and to be like me. Uh, Look, I saw okay. your show, Chili. The problem with dating, okay. what are you about to say? I'm just saying, Definitely I don't have- I will take my shoes off and <laughs> oh boy. get on this I'm just table. Saying, I'm just saying. Please do, please <laughs> do it. Please, it's our last show. I'm I'm just saying, I don't have the most money. I don't have like gold forks and knives like Floyd Mayweather Jr. <laughs> <laughs> no, see, what I, th I think that for a female, no matter how much money you make or not, 
every woman wants to feel like a princess, you know? And I think that, like, I don't look for a guy to pay my bills. Obviously, I can pay my own bills. I can do Amen. a lot of things for myself. And thank God, I'm, I've been blessed. Right. But I would love to be, you know, go on a date with the guy and he pay for it. And or if we plan a trip together, you know, if I have to pay half, then I need to go on that on that trip with my girlfriend, not a dude. Like, okay. no. I agree. Look, I would pay for it. I mean, I'm just saying. No, you ain't right, crowd. Look at these ladies. Look at the women. Look at the women. Look at the women. There you go. She's putting the expectation being like he should pay for everything. All and the you time. keep all your money, you never spend yeah. any money on him. That is the premise that she's kind of putting in place right now, which is really bad. And I hate that because women get entitled thinking that the man should pay for everything and that I don't have to do anything for him. Let's say he's in the top 10 percentile. Mm. And then let's say he loses that job or maybe that job lays him off or, you know, maybe he goes something back to happens. school or something yeah. happens. What happens then? She is gone too, because all she wanted was your money. Character traits in women that are really good to keep out for for the guys that are dating. Mm -hmm. I think um, generosity is a big one to look for in women. And also if she's able to make sacrifices. All right, guys, let us know what your thoughts are in the comment section. Do you think Chili's being entitled? Do you think she's being reasonable? Let us know.